Motley Squad, and welcome back to another review video. Today we are taking a look at some new motors, these beautiful fluorescent pink offering in 2810 from the company MEPS. The date is the 18th of October 2024, and today these are brand new to market, released just now, right now at this very time when this video went live by MEPS. They sent them to me a few days ago, I've had a chance to test them out, and you'll hear my honest thoughts. To get the elephant in the room out of the way, they were sent to me for free. I received no payment for this video. I've not been told to say anything. I've signed no contract that it must be a positive review. Everything within this review will be honest and will be my own thoughts and opinions. Now, onwards. The Neon 2810 FPV motors are ideal for 7 and 8 inch FPV drones, potentially leaning more to the side of carrying a heavier payload, so more for the aerial videography side really. So they're going to give you more power, more thrust to weight ratio to carry a heavier camera such as a GoPro, potentially something even a little bit heavier than that as well. That, however, isn't to say that it doesn't fly incredibly fast and isn't incredibly manoeuvrable with these motors, because it really is. So a few of the specs as provided by MEPS to me, they come in fluorescent green and fluorescent pink. If you were to view my last MEPS review from a few weeks ago, that is what the fluorescent green motors look like. These are the fluorescent pink. The previous review was of a different size motor, but if you need a comparison in what, which color to pick, go check that video. You can have a look at what they actually look like. You get a two year warranty with them. They weigh 67 grams each, including the wires. You're gonna need something really that's minimum to about a 60 amp ESC. And let's just admire them for a second because they Quite beautiful, really. Now, the price of them is $19.99 each. However, there is a very special promotion that is currently being run for the next few days, and I'll come to that later on in the video. So we'll move on to the flight test now. And I didn't have time to do a huge number of flights because I did only receive them a couple of days ago and I've had to build a drone and, and get everything ready. What you can see from this footage, though, is that they are fast, smooth, reliable. There's always a question that I can never answer that people will ask me is how well do they hold up and bando crashes and several crashes later. I'm not the type of pilot that crashes. I'm risk averse. I'm not saying that I'm better than anybody else. I'm not. I do crash. But I'm risk averse, especially when I'm making a video. So I'm not going to push it to the point of view where I crash it 10 times. If that's a question that you need answering, that's something I potentially couldn't answer at this stage, but give me six months, come back and ask again, I'll be able to answer it better for you. But I think we can see from the flight test here that the for $20, for such big, responsive, smooth, and let's be honest, attractive looking motors, you can't really go wrong with these ones.
Now moving on to the special promotional offer. So this video has gone live on Friday the 18th of October 2024 at 5 a.m. in the UK. Between now and October the 20th, if you were to buy four of the neon green or neon pink 2810 or 2812 FPV motors, you will then receive in the post five motors for the price of four. That offer ends on the end of the 20th of October and I have been asked to tell you that between the 18th and the 20th all other promotional codes will not be valid because of the fact that they're giving you five motors for the cost of four. Once the promotional period has ended you can then use any codes that you've got after that. So as always the final question when it comes to review videos is should you buy it and if you're looking for a cheap attractive cost effective smooth powerful responsive 2810 and i assume the 2812s are just as good motor the answer is yes if you're looking for something that you want to smash up in a bando constantly i can't answer whether these will be good for you but if you're the type of pilot that puts on an expensive camera to your fpv drone does cinematography work or even fly cinematography for fun rather than smashing a drone up these are the motors for you they're cheap they're quiet they're responsive they're efficient and they're damn attractive too i'll leave a link down below in the description go grab yours now you've got two days to get five for the price of four you won't want to miss out on these until next time peace